conflict is breaking out in southwestern China. Chinese Muslims facing off against police officers and crowds throwing stones at authorities. Sparking the clash, Chinese authorities attempt to demolish the roof of a mosque. Welcome to China in Focus. I'm Tiffany Meyer. Unrest in a majority Muslim town in southwestern China. On Saturday, clashes broke out between residents and police in Yunnan province following the forced demolition of a domed roof on a centuries-old mosque. Footage shows officers coated in body armor lined up outside the gate, barring the angry crowd from entering. Dozens of police vehicles stood by on the scene, prepared for potential arrests. The protest is believed to be related to a court decision in 2020, which outlawed some of the mosque's renovations. Following the incident, local police urged anyone involved in the conflict to surrender themselves before June 6 for a lighter penalty. In recent years, the Chinese Communist Party has further strengthened its control over religious groups like Muslims and Christians. And in the autonomous region of Xinjiang, home of the Turkish-language-speaking Uyghur Muslims, thousands of mosques and shrines have been destroyed. Millions of Uyghur Muslims are forced into mass detention and re-education camps as part of the CCP's campaign to assimilate all non-Han Chinese people.